Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to my pack opening video and we're here today and I'm actually, I seem to be getting pretty good players in these packs, I'm not entirely sure why but uh, you might just want to listen if you're not interested in the gameplay um, because today I'm going to be talking about a few FIFA 14 ideas that I um, asked, essentially I asked um, my Twitter followers and my Facebook um, follower people so I thought I'd just go through a few of them, I actually have a few of them myself, um, a few of them inspired by you guys on Twitter and Facebook. So um, the first one is actually one that I kind of thought up and I've ha had this idea for a little while now and what it would be is so on Ultimate Team, I'd love it if I could create a sort of league within my friends. So let's say I wanted to have a league between me, Air Japes, um, AA9 Skills, Nepenthes, KSI um, and just um, maybe a couple other people or whatever. And um, Say I wanted to have one of them and uh, you know you could play your league games and it would just create an awesome league. I'd love to be able to do that. To be able just to you know play not just for nothing almost because when I feel as though I play my friends it's just like playing one game and that's it. That You know that you, you gain nothing from it. There's nothing really that exciting about it and I just feel as though it kind of um, there's, there's a lot lacking in Ultimate Team that can be done in FIFA 14. Um, another, another big thing is uh, that I've seen a lot of you guys um, tweet me about um, is that you guys want to see single matches back or uh, yeah single matches so that you don't have to play a tournament or you don't have to play in division one and uh, I think that would be really good I kind of miss um, single matches because that is really where I kind of messed around and just farted around you know with uh, new teams teams that necessarily weren't that great but I enjoyed using them you know things like that that was always fun to do um, but they did take it out um, this time because they actually they actually did have divisions um, and they kind of replaced it with that um, I kind of yeah so yeah I do miss that and I, I hope they bring it back or um they at least do something a little bit more in innovative because I feel as though ultimate team is really kind of bland at the moment in the sense that there's not actually that much you can do um I mean you you know you can create your team but once you've done that I mean you essentially play in a division or you play in a tournament that's really about it I'd love something else you know be able to create a league with your friends would just be so cool um so yeah there's that um Another big thing is that, um, so I'll talk a little bit about career mode now. Um, career mode, I would absolutely love it if there was just a lot more detail in career mode. Um, I would really like it if if anyone has played Football Manager bef uh, before, you guys will know that there are just so many different options you can do. Let's, uh, for example, you know, there's PK, I have PK on my team, and I really want to improve his marking. You know, he's not marking very well, so I really want to improve that. I should be able to set his training schedule so that he focuses on his marking um, you know or let's say I have a striker um, you know I have Daniel Sturridge and his finishing just really isn't that great and I really want him to focus on finishing in uh, training um, you know I'd like it if I could be able to set that in his training schedule um, another thing would be um, for maybe both um, ultimate team and career mode I maybe on ultimate team it would be a little bit harder but certainly on career mode I just like there to be a lot more tactics that I have choices around you know I want to be able to decide who I can um, you know what sort of style of football I want to play um, just different uh, different sort of things you know maybe I can change the work rates of each player without having to go into the game I know you can change work rates when you get into the game and things like that but uh, or I just don't want to have to change it every time you know I want to be able to just have a lot more custom customization within the team. I feel as though that would make for a really, really cool sort of more depth within the game. I think that would be a really important part to it. Um, you know, there are a few people in there that have said they want to be able to have a button to dive in FIFA 14 and I believe what was it? Was it Pez that did that? No, I don't think it was Pez. There was a there was a football game where you could actually purposely dive. There was a button to dive, and oh my god, that was so funny. But uh, it would completely ruin FIFA, and I would hate to see it. So sorry, um, I just I'm not a fan of that. As funny as it might be, um, uh, one person here says. Um, at Andre Portuguese on Twitter says, I would make the fans more realistic, like on TV, see them go to the stadium in their club shirts, in the stands, etc. So, uh, just a bit more realism in the stadium. Um, I can actually kind of answer that question. Uh, I believe they weren't actually, they weren't capable of making the spectators that much more realistic because of the fact that there's only so much space on a disc, and, uh, you know, if you do any more of that stuff, then uh, it would they just don't have enough space on the disc. But, with the new introduction of next 
next gen consoles you know uh, I'm not I'm just gonna call it ps4 and Xbox 720 just for the sake of it for now um, you know they should be coming this year so hopefully um, the disk spaces will be much larger and we can have things like that so definitely in FIFA 14 um, I really hope that we'll be able to have things like that as um, you know just a, a lot more realism involved um, another one here from Ryan PW on Twitter it says more customization for your virtual pro um, I'd like to agree with that to anyone who's actually played NBA 2k 13 2k 12 the amount of different things you can adjust on your pro is just out of this world seriously um, like you can just change literally everything from his shooting style um, all that sort of stuff, you know, his dribbling style, stuff like that. If you could do that on FIFA 13, that would just be so cool, you know. Give your player a certain style, a certain, a certain way to go about him. I just think it would provide a lot more depth in uh, your virtual pro and uh, yeah I'd like to see that for sure let's take a look at my Facebook page now um, let me just refresh that a lot of people actually said like I don't want there I want there to be better servers and things like that I mean we can always say that but EA are EA and they will do what they will do um, with it so um, what one person here from Tommy um, Sarikio, Sarik, Sariko, I think is how you say his name. Um, he wants to see um, third kits in Ultimate Team, and uh, I can I can kind of sympathize with that. I'd like to see there be an alternate kit that you can have in FIFA 13 because that would be really cool. You know, have your home and away kit, and let's say you know they both clash for whatever reason, have that alternate kit, kind of like you do in what you call it, kind of like you do have in um, head to head. You know, you have that third kit that you can always resort to. Another thing that I'd really like to see is in fact the ability to have very rare and being able to unlock certain legendary kits if you will we already have it in ultimate team and i'm talking about the kits that you get um, if you if you unlock them in their catalog maybe if you unlock them in the catalog you also get them on ultimate team I'm not too sure how it would work but I'd like to be have have those ultimate um, you know, not ultimate legendary sort of kits that I could play in ultimate team not just restricted to head-to-head -head, because personally I don't play a lot of head-to-head -head, so uh, a lot of my games are in fact in um, what do you call it um, are in fact in ultimate team so I would like all that sort of stuff to be on ultimate team as well um, let's get a look here. So, um, Adam Wicks, I, I kind of agrees with me. He says, for career mode, hire coaches to help people grow in certain area like defending, attacking, and stuff like that. And that's exactly what I was saying earlier. You know, that would just be awesome. And I like the idea of hiring a certain coach, um, to focus on the defending, attacking. Maybe you could, depending on how good the coach is, you know, maybe you could get an informed coach that would work, um, or not an informed, what am I talking about? I'm getting confused with Ultimate Team here. You know, you could bring in the better the coach the better they work on certain players you know that sort of thing that would just be really really cool um one big thing for me that i would like to see in fifa 14 and i say that just as i pick up inform michu and i can't wait to try him out maybe a uh, player review on him i'm not entirely sure but he looks like he could be a lot of fun um one particular mode that i would really like to see is spectator mode and you might be wondering like cal that sounds so silly why would you want to be a spectator and i don't mean physically be in the stands of the game but uh you know hypothetically kind of yes i'd like to be able to so let's say uh, Nepo and AA are playing each other on um, Ultimate Team or on Head to Head. I'd like to be able to watch that. And you might, you guys might be like, Kyle, why would you want to waste your time watching any of these? Um uh, wh wh why would you want to waste your time watching other people's games? And it's not necessarily for that, but I think it could create so much um, cool things just outside of that. And when I say that, I mean like you could have tournaments. Tournaments would be made so much easier. You could have live tournaments. So, you know, let's say Nepo and AA had to play each other um, in a certain uh, time in the tournament. It means I could do it live. I could spectate it, stream it, and, you know, we could just have a really cool tournament. Um, it would make for some epic, epic videos that you could do. And, uh, I mean, it might be a little bit hard for you guys to see as people that might not make videos but uh, from a video making point of view I guarantee you spectator mode would just make FIFA so much more fun to watch and it would just make it 10 times better so um, although it might be hard for you guys to see why it would be um, you know uh, better then yeah just trust me it would be amazing Um let's take a look down my Facebook one okay so 
career mode. This is from Brandon Wells on Facebook. He says career mode where you can make your own team, create your own players, create their kits, unlock sponsors and more. So, you know, that's really cool. Create your own team and maybe you could put them in your own league, something like that. I think that's actually a really cool idea. Um, EA have really struggled with the whole customization side of things. You know, like I said, there is only a certain amount that you can fit on a disc, but they really have kind of let me and all you guys, all the FIFA fans down when it comes to customization. Because on FIFA, as we all know, we actually don't have a lot that we can customize. And I feel as though that would actually be a really cool idea. You know, maybe you, you have to start from the bottom. Um, you know, you have to start from right at the bottom leagues and you just have to work your way up and as you go up You pick up sponsors and you just not only are you a manager of a team But you're the owner of a team So you have to do everything such as hiring a manager or maybe you, you even manage the team as well I think that would create that would make career mode to take take it to a whole new depth And I think it'd be a really interesting idea. I'm not entirely sure how it would work, but um it's definitely possible, and that was a really nice uh, sort of um, idea there from Brandon. Um, next one scrolling down is, you know, let me take a look. Um, some people say there want to be an online career mode, and I think that would be so cool. Um, to be able to create, you know, if I want to play as Liverpool, Nepo wants to play as Arsenal, and Air Japes wants to play as Chelsea or whatever, I want to be able to have, like, an online career mode. I know it's possible in Football Manager. It's a little bit tedious on Football Manager. Well, the last time I played it, it was anyways. I don't know. They may have fixed that now. But I want to be able to play in an interactive league. If I go head-to-head -head against Nepenthes, I want to play my career mode team for versus his one and I think that would just be so awesome and oh my god I'd have so much more fun on career mode but guys that's it from me and uh, the rest of my Twitter and Facebook followers thanks to everyone who pitched an idea who, uh, who sent me over an idea and most importantly guys let me know in the comments what would you guys like to see in uh, FIFA 14 and you know you can always say better servers all those things but what sort of creative ideas um, game modes things like that would you guys like to see in FIFA 14 for me like I said all the things I sort of rec uh, I spoke about there were definitely things I'd like to see in FIFA 14. Just before I go, guys, I do want to say if you guys have forgotten about the Gamma Labs tournament, there will be a link in the description to um, that particular. Um, competition thing and uh, I did do a video on it so if you guys don't know what I'm talking about go ahead and check out that video that I'm talking about it'll be on my um, YouTube page if you want to go and see that pretty much you get to go and blow awesome stuff up and uh, yeah that you have to be 14 and over that's about the only restriction and uh, go and check that video out and like I said the competition link will be in the description guys I hope you all have a cracking day I'll see you in a bit bye bye